So this is what we're doing today. A Christmas winter cabin inspired nail design, complete with a winter cabin scenery, snowy forest, and a nice and cozy granny's blanket to snuggle up under. All of these nails were stamped so no skills needed. You can find links to all the products used in the description box. I hope you enjoy. I start with prepped nails, but I've left my pinky and pointer unpainted for now. The stamping plates I'll be using today is the QA31, BPL015 and Y006. All of these are available on warmprettystore.com. I'm also going to use my XL stamper and two of my stamper refills. These can also be bought on warmprettystore.com, link down below. Let's start by covering the pointer and pinky in white snowflake glittery polish from Nail Sync. Over it, I'm using this tree pattern from the BPL 015 stamping plate, and I'm using OPI Amazon Amazoft to stamp with. My camera managed to run out of battery while I was filming, so I didn't notice that it wasn't on while I was stamping with the Y006 stamping plate. So here I'm just adding in some colors to the stamp that will become the granny blanket. For some texture, I'm adding a coat of Nail Sync Alexa Lace to my red nail. When the stamp has dried, I place it on my nail, rub it a bit, and then proceed to remove the excess. Now for the Christmas winter cabin, or maybe it's Santa's house, who knows. I start with a gradient. This will be the ground and sky for the scenery. Adding some clear polish to my uber chic mat, link down below by the way. And I'm just stamping directly onto the polish on the mat. I can now just peel this off and cut them into small decals. Santa needs his reindeer, so I'm making one for him. For the cabin, I'm doing the same that I did with the blanket, stamping with black and then filling in the colors afterwards before sealing it with a clear polish. Making decals like this is very easy and it gives you much more control over where you place the image on your nail. I recommend using a clear polish or a regular top coat, but not a quick dry one. These often make the decals quite brittle. And now that all the decals are done, I can easily arrange them on my nail. If you're having trouble making them stick, you can always apply a thin coat of clear polish or top coat to the nail before placing them. Now 
Now all I need to do is trim off the excess, add some snow and seal with a top coat. And here's the finished result. Now I know the blanket nail isn't the prettiest, but this is what the blankets that my granny used to knit look like. So for me, it's looking very cozy. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and found it inspiring. If you did, please click the like button and if you're not already subscribing, please do for more weekly nail art goodness. If you have any requests, a video you want me to make or just a question, please make a comment below and I'll come back to you as soon as possible. Remember to say hi to me on Instagram at Trommelaken. See you soon! Bye bye!